Hello and welcome to my entry for a database of the week. This is ProQuest Earth Atmospheric and Aquatic Science Collection. As you can see here, I've loaded the advanced search page. It allows you to select by source type, document type. You can choose what language you want your results to appear in. Down here we have result page options. You can sort it by relevance, oldest first, most recent first. You can choose the number of items per page. We have additional filters down there. Up here, which I think is pretty helpful, is the thesaurus. I'm going to move that down. So for example, Say, add comma there, say I'm looking for tuna. It gives, you, it gives you suggestions to use. For example, we've got tuna fisheries here. If I tap that, it shows you what to use that term for. Say I'm looking for Albacore Fisheries. Close that. And go here to Advanced Search. I think we're just going to look in anywhere for that. Um, And that's a lot of results, 3,042. Let's see. Let's say I'm trying to cut it down by magazines. That's how you can Filter that down. Let's try because there's three different thesauri here. Let's say I'm looking up Comet. Interesting. Um, let's see, we're looking at something more specific this time. Abstract. And see here, you can add a row if you want to add a row. Remove a row.
for articles. Source type can be everything. Search. Hmm. Let's see, unlike the previous one, that's a very little result. But what if I get rid of observation and I just wanted to bring up things telling me about Haley's comment? Only three. <laughs> hmm. Let's see what this one looks like. See, that's helpful. It gives you the, the volume, the issue, number of pages in the magazine versus the number of pages of the article. The URL appears the, if you want to download it, you want to cite it. Yeah, that's really helpful. Um, you want to email it to someone, print it. All your options. This is also extremely helpful. You can translate it to another language. So you want to go from going from English. Try a couple of these. Go to Spanish, translate. Suddenly it's in Spanish. So you want to try non Roman alphabet, go to Japanese. Translate that translates that section. Do the same down here if I wanted to do the same down here. Oh, look at that. It tells you how long it'll take to translate. That's actually really helpful because if it's something longer, depending on how much time you have, Check that out. That is pretty cool. I can definitely see this being... This is definitely a helpful resource if you're looking for... Let's see. We have field codes over here. Search tips. And it also has suggestions down here, which I think is helpful if you're not entirely sure what exactly it is that you want to type in. It's a clear form. 
We set you back to where you were originally. And that's the ProQuest Earth Atmospheric and Aquatic Science Collection. Oh, and here's publications. So if you want to browse by publication itself, you can do that. And also... You can go here and change databases. I think that's if you're going to navigate to other databases within this, um, within ProQuest. Pretty neat. Thank you for, thank you for watching.